What's up, everybody? It's Mr. You Know Who from XMR Gaming, and today I'm bringing you guys a new 2014 tutorial on how to find your user ID and your console ID for brute force save data. I made a previous video last year showing you guys how to find your user ID and your console ID, but it only helps some. So today I'm here to bring you a easier way on how to find your user ID and your console ID for brute force save data 4.6 so you guys can start reconciling saves and if you don't know what I'm talking about I'm gonna show you right now so when you open up brute force save data for the first time you're not gonna it'll just be blank and it's gonna ask you to put in your user ID and your console ID and if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm going to show it to you right now. Just right click, go to settings, global settings, and open it. Now right here, it's going to ask for your user ID and your console ID. Once you have these two, you can then go ahead and start reassigning saves to your account. But if we don't do this, it will not work for you to reassign saves reassign saves correctly so let me show you the easy way on how to get your user ID and your console ID so what you want to do is I'm using a tool called PS3 pattern.sfo editor and what this allows you to do is get your console ID and your user ID and you don't have to guess this all you need is a save that has the param.sfo inside the save, which most saves have that in there. So I'm going to use my Batman Arkham Origin save, which is on my desktop right here. So what I'm going to do is click on it, go to my param.sfo, open. It tells me the game, my account, and all I want to do is go over to the side change it to my param user id one or oh, oh, param sorry param user d1 and right here is my account id or my user id so let's go back to brute force save that i'm going to reopen it for you go to settings global settings and my user id that you see inside of param.sfo editor this right here is what I would put inside of my user ID right here now I need my console ID now I go back inside ps3 param.sfo editor I'm going to go to param psid and this is my console ID right here and I would just copy this Go back inside of brute force save data and copy my console ID here and hit close. Once I have these two information put in, then I can start reassigning saves to my account. And that's pretty much it. Um, I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. If you're looking on how to download the PS3 pattern.sfo editor, I will have all links below. You could just click on that and you can download it. Um, if you need brute force save data 4.6, I'll also have a link below so you guys can download that, which is the latest version and last version of brute force save data. There is no other version higher than 4.6. Um, that's for a later video. I'll explain what happened with brute force save data, but yes, yeah, 4.6 is the last and highest brute force save data there is. Um, like I said before, if you're looking on, on how to download uh, PS3 Power.SFO editor, links will be low. Other than that, guys, I hope this tutorial will help you out. I hope you guys now understand how to find your console ID and user ID the easy way without um, any miscommunication on how to find it. As always, it's Mr. You Know Who from XMI Gaming. Check out my gaming channel. Um, I'll be making more videos for you guys. Um, I'm going to be making a couple more 
videos on Brute Force Save Data and try to answer all your questions on Brute Force Save Data that you guys are having problems with. Um, I've been gone for some time because I've been at school, but I'm back. Semester's over and I'm here to help you guys as I said before look out for my gaming channel I have more videos coming with all the latest games um, I'll also have for you guys um, more saves modded saves so you guys can use um, if you're having trouble with proof or save data you could just go to my review of that game and below would have that save with whatever mods are applied and then all you have to do is go inside a proof or save data reassign it for yourself and you can use it um, as I said before it's Mr. You Know Who from XMI Gaming check out my gaming channel and peace